what is up you guys welcome back to another video it's phantom here and in today's video i'm going to be showing guys how to get onto a good server so you can serve so in my last video i did a video on how to beat surf utopia and so in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to join good surf servers because after the transition from CSGO over to CS2, the amount of servers that are on CS2 is pretty lacking. I mean, I uploaded that video around January or February of this year, and we're in September now, so it's been, what, like seven, eight months now, and the amount of servers is still pretty lacking, so... Uh, once you get onto CS2, as you can see, we're on it right now. And you click up here where it says play in the middle. And then it'll load this little screen up here. And then so you're going to click right here where it has this little globe. It's, this is for like the community servers. And so once you click on it, it'll open this new tab right here. And as you can see, uh, there are some maps already preloaded in here. And so you can click up here. At the top right and click where it says counter-strike 2 and then here at the bottom where it says change filters i'll click on there and where it says map type in surf s as in sam u as in unicorn r as in rainbow f as in foxtrot underscore and then you can click up here the magnifying glass so you can search and so it's going to be searching for some of the um, maps that are available and as you can see, there are actually quite a decent amount right now. Uh, I'm not going to lie. Whenever I was, uh, what's it called, preparing to record this video, as you saw, right before I hit the by not, or right before I hit the magnifying glass, there's probably only like six maps loaded in. But now there's actually quite a decent amount. Um, so this is actually quite a lot. Uh, as you can see, we have Surf Waterworks. That one's decently easy. Surf Whiteout. That one's also kind of easy. Surf Utopia was the one I did a video on last time. Surf Kitsune and Surf Beginner. These are like the two maps that I would honestly recommend to try and beat first before you move on to any of the other maps. Because the thing about Surf Kitsune and Surf Beginner is these are stage maps. And so it's not like Surf Utopia, which is what we call linear. A linear map means that there are no save points. So if you fall off the ramp, you have to restart all the way from the beginning. But with Surf Kitsune and Surf Beginner, these are stage maps. So you could be the first stage, uh, second stage, third stage. And let's say you fail on the fourth stage, you start again on the fourth stage. You don't go all the way back to the first stage. And so as you can see, we actually do have quite a lot of maps here. Uh, which is pretty good, but as you can see, most of these have zero people on there. So these are like what we call ghost servers or promotional servers, which I would not recommend joining. And so uh, I'm going to show you guys a different way to join maps. So honestly, after the transition from CSGO to CS2, this little search browser thing that they implemented is pretty bad. It's really atrocious, I would say. And so there is this website. So we're gonna open a browser, so Chrome or Internet Explorer, whichever one you guys want. And then you're gonna go to google.com or honestly, you can just go up here to the top and you're gonna type in cs2browser.com. So like that, like how I have it right now on the search bar. So C as in Charlie, as in Sam, the number two, and then browser, B as in Bravo, R as in Rainbow, O as in Oscar, W as in West, as in Sam, E as in Echo, R as in Rainbow.com, and you click enter. And then here you can see a bunch of other maps that this website is actually keeping track of, which is really nice. And so right here where it says search by host name or map, we're gonna click on there and then we're gonna type in surf underscore and then click enter. 
or I think it actually already automatically searches for them. And as you can see, we have some maps that were actually not even on there. So Surf Nix is on here. Surf Lockdown is on here. I don't think um, Surf Lockdown was, oh, it is on here. So as you can see, we have Surf, Surf Lockdown. Surf Nix is on here, but it's not on here. Uh, Surf Waterworks, Surf Boreas is on here, it's not on here. Surf Utopia is on here, uh, another duplicate. So Surf Whiteout's on here too. And we have a bunch of maps on here that you could join that are not on the CS2 search. So uh, let me see. So yeah, like Surf Rookie is not on here. I didn't see it. Surf Rookie is another one that I would recommend for beginners to try and beat. Yeah, so it's not even on here. So let's go to Surf Rookie. So in order to join it, all you have to do is just click right here on this um, little play button. So it say join now. And then this will pop up and then just click open Steam. And then it'll download the map for you. And then once you have it downloaded, you'll be able to join it. And so this is honestly one of the best maps that you can uh, learn how to surf because it's pretty easy. This is a stage map, which is really nice. So uh, I'm not really going to go into, you know, detail on how to beat this, but I mean, it's pretty simple. And as you can see, this, these are like the first two stages. It's pretty easy. So I would honestly recommend uh, Surf Kitsune, Surf Rookie, and Surf Beginner as some of the um, early maps or some of the first maps to try and beat and uh, as you can see cs2 is still pretty glitchy when it comes to their community server maps so but uh, i still have my overlay so if you guys want to you know watch a little bit but yeah and so then i already beat the first what was that like five stages this is like stage six so it's pretty easy uh and it has those those um, hexagons right there and it has six squares in each so this one's an 18 stage map it's pretty easy and you can see that little red square right there that's what stage you're currently at so we beat this one um, then the little square will move to the next stage so it's there we go it's on the orange one now so yeah this one's pretty easy um, and so exit to menu, and then we can just go back to our browser over here. And so you can honestly just join any of these maps. Uh, but like I said, surf Kitsune, surf uh, beginner, and surf rookie. Those are going to be your th these three right here. These are going to be your three best bets to learning how to surf. And so, yeah, just remember this website, cs2browser.com in order to join servers or you know you can just search them here on the city probably updated it or something between my um preparing to record this video but this, still this this little search engine is still not as good as this website so i would honestly recommend to stick to the website and honestly just like you know join join the ones that have a lot of people if you want to you know talk to some people they might give you some tips and tricks Surf Kitsune still has 11 people on there. That's pretty good. And um, Surf Lockdown, Surf Nix, Waterworks, Boreas. Those are medium level, I would say. Whiteout's a little bit easier, but I would honestly recommend going for the other three that I mentioned earlier. So, but yeah, just uh, keep this um, website in mind. And, you know, there's also other things. There's not, there's not just Surf. There's also Zombie Escape maps that you can join. Uh, bunny hop maps, which are honestly a little bit hard. So I would probably stick to surfing before moving on to the bunny hop maps. And um, yeah, if there's other stuff that you want to do, they're on here, which is pretty cool. And so, but yeah, if you want to just do surf, you can just click right here and it'll show you all the surf maps. And so, but I would honestly recommend sticking to the surf underscore maps because there's other surf maps, but they're, they have like, team deathmatch type of surf maps so if you just want to like relax and surf and just have a good time you know you just do surf underscore and these are like the chill surf maps that you can just surf alone not worry about getting laid out and 
rage quitting basically so but yeah um stay tuned i'm gonna be uploading more surfing videos soon i'm gonna be posting how to beat some of these other uh surf maps like surf wideout surf nix surf beginner surf rookie and hopefully they start adding more maps in because i still haven't added surf summer surf summer was my my go-to map so hopefully they'll add it soon but yeah guys it's been phantom hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and hopefully you guys learned something new and uh take it easy peace out